another round of house, six years, another round of house and Senate seats up. Uh, so hopefully there'll be a big enough group of people by then. Uh, and we can help them as long as they're interested in uh, the same values that, that I hold, which is campaign finance reform, ending Citizens United, getting the money out of politics. Because until we do that, it's just, you know, the cats are going to take care of the cats. That's it. Uh, and there's a lot there's a lot of talk, you know, about democracy in America right now. But I think it's important for folks that don't know to understand the history of Nebraska, where you've got the bicameral. You've had a, a, a history in that state of independence. Uh, you've had, you know, mavericky, you know, moderate, independent, also specifically veterans. You've had Bob Kerry there, who I know has endorsed your campaign, Medal of Honor recipient. You've had Chuck Hagel, who went on to become Secretary of Defense. But there's a unique atmosphere that's been created in Nebraska also that kind of primes the pump for Nebraska not only to elect you, but to be a model for this country.